audience. What is up guys, it is Nick. We are back and I wanted to thank you all for 10,000 subscribers. We hit 10K yesterday, I believe I got the email. Uh, I appreciate it all guys. Thank you so much and thanks everyone who has stuck around. I'll have a little bit of a special 10K video. Uh, won't be anything crazy. I'll probably just go back through and grab a couple of clips from different stuff and I'll add a couple of clips from when I was gone on different live streams that I was a part of. So I'll, uh, I'll throw those in somewhere. Uh, probably throw them at the beginning of that video. I don't know. I don't know. But there'll be a video tomorrow for 10K. Just a thank you to all of you. I uh, wanted to say it in this video, and then obviously I'll get it in tomorrow's video. But as you can see, we are starting up Konoichi because... It doesn't have its Awakening yet, so I'd like to get there, and then I'd like to do videos when the Awakening comes to Xbox. I have about three weeks i think at this point or a little bit less like two weeks two and a half weeks to get there so we're gonna run this exactly like i would run my um uh how i ran like my usual videos on sorceress at the very beginning of this we're just going to i'm gonna play off camera i'll do some bosses on camera and then we'll just play and and just kind of one cut play and that's how we'll do this character I'll have more of these videos than I will of Valk, but we'll progress Valk as kind of the newer way I've been doing it, which is editing out boring stuff and having newer stuff. The character is based on Asuna from Sword Art. Hopefully this doesn't make too much noise, but this is my Asuna figure, okay? You guys know I collect them as, like, we got Elizabeth that hangs out in the actual video every time, but this is probably my favorite figure that I own. It's just really well done. Um, I haven't obviously got the Siri that I want yet, so I don't know. She might pass because I love Siri, so that might pass. But for now, that ordinal scale, uh, I think it's 1-6 scale Asana or 1-7 scale Asana, is my favorite one that I own, even though I do really like Elizabeth that, you know, gets to be in every video because she sits on that part of my desk. Uh, but let's get into this. We're just going to progress this like uh, like normal. We're just going to go through here at the very beginning. Um, oh, I don't remember. I, I think I screwed I screwed this up last time. How on earth did we start this initial quest? Do we do Black Spirit? Yes, we do. But yeah, I decided I wanted to try to do this before it came out. The Awakening came out because I thought, you know, we got a new character. Would probably be good if I... Um, took the time to progress the the newest character kind of i guess so that is what we are going to do pretty simple uh i probably will skip ahead a ways for the next episode i'll probably try to play a decent chunk here without you guys um just to get us to a place that i can try to get there before it comes out i think i should have no problem 56 ain't too bad um you guys know I kind of nailed down the 50, I think it's like 54, where you kind of run out of story quests and you got to kind of do other stuff. But yeah, I think it's about there. And whenever we hit that, I will uh, definitely be just grinding helms. Because I love that place. And okay, there's also chances I want to play characters because I want to see if I like them. And, like, this so far, low-key, kind of okay. Like, Valk didn't... I love Valk, but, like, I love some of the characters I play. But, man, like, quick movements like this that I can do. Holy shit, this is fun. Like, ooh, it's got that ninja. I know it's the female version of the ninja, but it's got that ninja attack that I really loved. That creates, like, that ninja star. Okay, is this weapon just, like, OP, or is this character just, like, a lot stronger than everybody else? Because, like, on Valk, I, I had to, like, slowly murder stuff. This thing is just, like, straight demolishes. That's an... I like that attack. But, yeah. So, on this character, it was mostly about, like, can we... Let's get to Awakening and see how things go and see if I, you know, like the character and whatnot. But... It was also about, like, it's also about, like, you know, it's the newest character, so I should probably play it while it's new, opposed to waiting until it's old. 
Uh, Valk's been out for a while. Valk Awakening is out, so that's not that big of a deal. But that's that's why we're doing this. But we'll just have two video. We'll just have two series going on the channel, and then once I finish up whichever one I drop, because I'm not gonna keep. I can barely play my Sork, so even if I love one of these characters, there's no real guarantee that I actually play it a whole lot. But yeah, then we were gonna go back because someone really wanted me to do Tamer. They wanted me to go back and work on Tamer, so we're gonna go back to Tamer at uh, a later date and finish her up. But yeah, there's plenty of characters for us to work on and finish up. I still need to probably play Ranger on Xbox because I have not played Ranger on Xbox. Um, I played it on PlayStation. Obviously, we didn't get very far. And obviously, I have to buy the... See, Ranger is up on my list of favorite characters just because of one of the outfits i really love the outfit and I, I know it's it's like pretty basic like everybody loves the outfit but um which one is it i don't think it's gotha rensa is it gotha rensa yeah it's the gotha rensa it's this one i just really like that outfit like i really like white um white armors and white stuff like in white uh like color palettes i guess light color palettes so that's, I really like, I just really like that one. Okay, now we're doing a little bit less damage, but we're still kind of hitting hard. So on this character, we're progressing kind of at a normal, let's learn the game pace again on my Valk. On this character, we're just buying a god tier weapon and going from there. Like, I'm not, I'm not, we're not messing around on this character. It's god tier weapon, progress fast. And once I get near... I don't know, once I get to like 45s, 50s, I'll probably take the gear off of my Sork and throw it on this character just until we hit 56. Because I don't want to have to buy like high quality gear for this character. But until then, I, I'm not going to die, so it's not really that big of a deal. Um, I need to kill Tree Spirits now. Okay, three more Tree Spirits. I do like um, this LTRB attack because it lets you get from one mob to the next. It doesn't have a long... It doesn't have a super long radius to kill. Uh, to, or, well, not to kill, but to hit. But it's, like, long enough that I think we'll, it'll get the job done. I think. I'll just have to keep playing with it through the flow of combat. But I think overall it should be good enough to get stuff done. Uh, I also wanted to talk about... So I'm going to start streaming again. I'll probably give it a few weeks here. Um, I'm still trying to figure out exactly what my routine is going to be here with me not in college. Um, with a little bit more free time. So I got to figure out what my routine is going to be. Probably will end up being early morning streams which i know isn't the best for everyone i also do i also am going to be changing up the upload time so i know the upload time has been 9 p.m recently 9 p.m eastern i'm thinking i'm going to change it up to the morning um i'll probably do it at like 9 10 probably 10 eastern 10 in the morning eastern is when i am planning to upload it right now but obviously that type of stuff can change at any point but that's the that's the idea this video is going to go up at nine uh whenever i take a day off is when i'm going to well when i take a day off from an upload i'm gonna change it that day so you'll know as soon as i take a day off the next day the upload the next day an upload goes up will be at the morning slot I just haven't figured out what time in the morning I wanted, so I've left it at the at night for now. It does have a little bit of tracking, I think. that It has like a base distance that it goes, but if there's a guy, it kind of helps warp you a little bit farther to get to the guy. I need to figure out which button combos I want to do. I really like this attack, but it just doesn't really hit that hard. And we gotta figure out kind of different, uh, figure out the combos and stuff like that, which I'll do on this character all off camera for you. 
if you want to see me learn combos, we can you can do it on the Valk, because I'll be doing... We're going to take that character a lot more slow and a lot more kind of calculated, I guess. This character is just kind of a bum rush to 56, and then we can do the Awakening stuff when that comes out. So I'll definitely be playing a decent chunk of this on my own, off camera, and it will just be simply based on, hey, I'm recording today, so let me do a Konoichi episode wherever I am. Uh, yeah, so sometimes we might, you might get a massive skip from me. We might go from, like, I don't know. Like, like at the end of this video, we'll end with Red Nose, as I always do in episode ones. But you might not, we might not come back until, like, I'm level 29 or something like that. Because I'm just going to play this afternoon and see and see where I can get it. Uh, I'm not feeling too hot today. Uh, I had an appointment early this morning. Um, and, it, yeah, I just didn't get a great night of sleep. So I'm a little bit tired, just not feeling the hottest. But I wanted to make this video for you guys. Um, and then I want to work on, obviously, that 10K video that's going to happen. Are you here to meet with Captain Cliff? Uh, just grab the main quest. I don't need any side. There was only one outfit for this character that I really liked, so that's the one I picked. Uh, it's the Rosa de Sharon, uh, which is a newer outfit in the game, but it's the one I chose for this. The, Sicar the Sicarius, um, kind of your classic ninja look, but I don't really love that. And then I don't like Carlstein at all, so obviously not very many options for me. Because obviously it's a new character, it's not like the original ones that have 5 billion options. Did I get a new weapon yet? Because that would be great, because this weapon is already starting to suck. Um, well, we got something that's going to improve our attack. The triple kunai. Increase our damage a little bit. There we go. Get in here. Ooh, that's a nice attack. I don't really like. I don't really like that it goes back, but that's actually kind of nice. Not going to lie. I will probably go grab a weapon uh, as soon as we get the chance. Um, probably before we fight Red Nose, I'll probably go grab it. All right, so we got the militia weapon box. And now we gotta kill 20 steel imps. Let's get us up to 12. Um, I'm actually, you want, let's go do it now. We're gonna go grab it now. So we guys gotta go over to Velia to pick it up. So let's go ahead and run over. We'll do our shopping now, and then we'll run it back. So what, what, we're using the ninja weapon. So militia, short sword, and triple kunai. Okay, so central market. Let's see here main weapons short sword right yes could just go with the ultimate steve for now but i feel like that's a little bit we can do better than that i could just do the duo laverto i think that would work duo laverto but that's expensive and i don't really want to buy that so what's the one i usually do as well as well um there is no as well up the highest is okay Let's see, Callus? Is there a Callus up? Nope. Guess I can't get picky. Elsh? There's a 13 to 15 Elsh. Bears? There is a duo bear. Oh, there's a tri bears up, which is 90 million. I mean, at that price, I. Uh, duo is not bad. Duo is kind of a fair price. Rosar, try Rosar. Try Rosar is actually pretty good. It's 97 to 102, which outweighs the Laverto duo by a little bit. Yeah, let's go try Rosar. We'll get try Rosar. I know that the Laverto is probably the better choice. Bang for buck. But I do really like the con. Eh, eh. I'm going to take the Laverto because I don't think the Laverto is going to go down in price crazily. It's a little bit worse, but I don't think it's going to like drastically dip in price so we're gonna pick that up and then let's go ahead and pick up a kunai secondary i don't need this to be insane uh i just want the one with attack so here we go um that's a little bit lower than i'd like oh uh, 
Okay, I guess I'm gonna have to... Let's just take the Tad. Let's take Tad. Um, there's an 11 to 12. Eh, I'm just gonna leave it for now. I don't like any of that. Okay. So let's get to the Central Market. Pick up our weapon, and then we can get back to what we were doing. Normally, I'd buy Ultimate Steed and just ride it out, but... I want to try to do this quickly. We're trying to do a speed run to 56, which one at some point in the game, some point in time, I'm going to do two different versions of speed runs. I don't know. That'll probably be for when we're at a really big content drought in the game. Right now, we're not at a super crazy content drought or anything. Um, I actually have an Estique Kunai, so we're going to take that out. Um... I might as well take this Agarian stuff and put it all on. We'll get better, but for now, I might as well I might as well wear the full Agarian set. Um, and I'm going to take some of these teas. I'm going to take 10 of them. I have plenty of them. And I think that's that's good. Okay. So let's go ahead and equip all this armor. Doesn't, like, crazily increase our armor, but it's good enough. And there's that. I'm going to put the T's down here in the corner. And I'm actually going to pop a T. Because we might as well get a little bit of bonus XP. And now we can get back to what we were doing. Um, oh, crap. i got to select the quest. Steal imps. Get back, to, get back to our imp murdering. And this should clean up fairly quick. We should be able to get and slaughter... Red nose here in the next few minutes. But yeah, I'm super excited to try out this character. Uh, I like the play style so far. Obviously, haven't got the skills or anything, so we'll have to see how that goes here. Um, I'm going to probably look up different builds and then build my own off of suggestions that I find online. That's probably what I'll do. Because on my Sork, I kind of built my own rotation on Sork. And I love my rotation on Sork. I know it's probably not optimal, and it's probably not the best Sork build you can have, but I really love my rotation on Sork. I have fun with it, and that's really all I'm aiming for in this game, is just to have fun, have a good time. Um, obviously not taking this super seriously, seeing as I have a level 58 as my highest account. Um, but yeah, with that being said, I just try to find fun rotations and ones that aren't like super sweaty like min maxi um there's a little min maxing with my sork but overall it's not super min maxi it's not like i have to do this this and this and if i don't do it then you know the whole entire combo is broken is that one? oh it is okay i can use my favorite attack because it's a one shot now Yo. Like how there's just like random tree spirits here. It doesn't make any sense for them to be here, but there's just like a couple of random ones. There's 12. This will be really fun to like walk up to a group and just slaughter them with this for a little while. And there's 19. Should be able to grab this one on my way back. Nice. Okay. Collect our quest reward, the Imp Stronghold, so now we need to go talk to Tiny Nose. Grab a little free XP along our way here. If I, okay, can I hit this dude? I overestimate my lunging ability. Oh, slice him up. Um, oh yeah, I gotta go to the actual cave entrance. Because this thing wants to take you, like, around. If you just follow, like, the arrow, it doesn't really indicate to go down, so it kind of leads you to where he would be, but on top of the hill. Alright, Tiny Nose. So the goal, episode-wise, is, like, one of these every... Like, for every episode of Valk that I upload, I want to upload two of these, because I think that'll... I think that'll make it so that we get done in time before The Awakening comes out. I think. I say that with, like, minimal confidence. But I think... I think that's accurate. If I do an episode like that, I, th I think. 
there'll obviously be a level 54 episode, 55, and 56 episodes, so I have to account for those three episodes. I might be able to combine 55 and 54, or just skip one of those episodes, but overall I do have to account for that stuff. Alright, so now we need to go slaughter 50 steel imps. You have to kill about 100 imps here. One of these days I'm going to do just a straight power level, skip the story one, because I think it would be more, it'll be fun. But I don't know when I'm going to do that, because the story, if you, if you just rush the story like I tend to do, it's actually pretty darn quick to just rush the story. Not going to lie. It is pretty damn easy. Um, do we want to try this? I don't know if this was a smart decision, but I'm going to do it. Okay, okay, bud. Oh, God, I hate you, Dastard Beg, so much. I'm going to kill these guys up here because I want the progress. Hey, chill, buddy. Dastard Beg, I beg, I beg, chill for just a second. See, I, I think I could get him if I just, you know, but if I keep getting caught by his stupid... I don't know what this is going to get me, but... I kind of want to kill him, since I bought this weapon. And this adds a little bit of an excitement to this episode that's pretty much just me one-shotting stuff. I don't even know if I can kill him. This is kind of a little sketchy. Okay, get, get up, get up, get up, get up. Get up. Okay, this might we might be death here. We might be death bound. Get ooh, 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 get get juked. Get juiced, dastard bag. There we go. I mean I'm not gonna fight him forever. I don't really know how much health I can't see how much health he has, so I can't tell if I've done any damage whatsoever. Hold on. Come on, get me health, get me health. Oh, I shot, oh my god, I thought I dodged that. Oh, here comes the death, here comes the death. Okay, hold on, hold on. Run away for a second. Follow me, Dastard Bag. So you don't lose your aggro. I don't want you losing your aggro, but I also needed to heal. Ooh, I dodged through that, but got hit. And there's the death. I don't know. I might not be able to handle... He, he might just be a little bit too much for me. A little bit too much for me. Please don't come after me again. Normally, I'd be, like, all for slaughtering him, but I don't actually think I'm strong enough. I thought I might be with the weapon, but... I, yeah, I don't know. I take a little bit too much damage to be doing that. Alright, so let's slaughter everything here. Up to level 14 already. Probably not next episode of this, but, like, two episodes from now, I will have... Um, I'll probably have some skills worked out. What do we need to kill still? I need to kill five regular imps. Okay, so now I just need regular imps. Regular imp warriors. So I need the ones with the shields. Hello, buddies. One more to go. Let's get this dude over here. There we go. And now, I believe it's Dastard Bag time. Really, really, bud. Yep, Red Nose Secret. Let's go back and talk to Tiny Nose, who has very nicely come to the tree right here. Hey, buddy. Give me the secrets on good old Red Nose. Okay. I probably should figure out something different to start every new episode with, but I kind of like start every series with the same 
premise. Why is there someone's red nose here? Someone just like summoned red nose and then just kind of left him chilling. Or is that like field boss red nose? I don't think that's field boss red nose. All right, let's dance, Red Nose. You and me, bud. And there he goes. <laughs> I got. There's something so satisfying about killing him before he can even attack once. There really is. Truly, there's something quite satisfying about it. Not even gonna lie. It's hella satisfying to just smoke his shit. Okay. Let's summon the Black Spirit. That's pretty much, that's pretty much episode one. And uh, like I said, this format's gonna follow like the. It's gonna be a little bit more of an aggressively sped up, uh, Sork. How I played Sork. That's pretty much what it's gonna be. It's just gonna be a more aggressively sped up Sork. And I, I think I think it should be good, some good fun. Uh, but that's essentially what it's gonna be. It's just gonna be an aggressively sped up Sork. Um, so if you remember how I played Sork, if you haven't seen that before, that was the very first series I did. It was my main character. And so, yeah. Um, it's going to be kind of based like that, but it's going to be a little bit more skippy ahead and more aggressively skip ahead. So, yeah. I hope you guys enjoyed this episode, though. Drop a big old like if you did. Subscribe if you have not. Uh, thank you again for 10k subscribers. I'll see you guys tomorrow in that video. I'll have a 10,000 subscriber video. Probably just a short thank you at the beginning. Um, and, uh, just a couple of short clips, uh, just thanking you guys. And, uh, yeah, that's gonna do it. I hope you all enjoyed. Peace.